friends, welcome to my channel. Today's video is an exciting one. It is another Fashion Nova haul. Today's video is actually in collaboration with um, Fashion Nova. They did send me these items, but I say this all the time in every single one of my videos that my reviews are always 100% honest. Um, I'm not going to say I like an item just because they sent it to me. So, just wanted to clear that out of the way because I'm not that type of person to you know, say I like something when I don't, I'm just, I just speak the truth. So, so for today's video, it's mainly focused on jeans because it is their kind of denim campaign. So with back to school coming up, I figured this video would be great for you guys because we don't have that much um, of summer left, so jean season is coming upon us soon. So I figured this video would be great for that. So I have done several Fashion Nova videos before. I'm gonna leave them linked all down below where I try a bunch of other items as well. Um, I love their jeans so much. I pretty much only own Fashion Nova jeans and then a couple of random other brands. But my collection is pretty much all Fashion Nova at this point because they are the only jeans that I feel really comfortable in. They're stretchy, they fit really nice on the body, and all the hype is worth it, trust me. Um, so let's get into the video. I did do like the try on portion separately So I'm gonna put those clips in as I talk about each item if you guys have not subscribed to my channel Please do so down below also hit that thumbs up if you guys enjoy these kinds of videos Also, I do have a coupon code with Fashion Nova I will leave it up here and also in the description and also in the description box down below So you guys can save some money who wouldn't want to save some money come on Alright, so let's just jump right in. Alright, so they did also send me a couple tops to pair with the jeans. Um, they sent me eight pairs of jeans, so I'm going to be showing you guys a lot. So the first thing is that I'm going to talk about is actually a top because I paired it with these pair of jeans that I'm going to talk about um, next. I'm also going to leave the prices of each item in somewhere on the screen so that you guys can see. Alright, so the first item is just a basic white bodysuit. It is ribbed material, which I love. I think it's so flattering and it's super stretchy. I did get this in a size small. Fits absolutely perfect. I paired it with these jeans, which might be my favorite jeans out of this whole haul. So these are the Naya skinny jeans. I got this I got these in a size 1 and they retail for $34.99. These are just a gorgeous blue jean. I love the wash of them. I think they're so flattering. They do have uh, a couple rips here, but it's not like anything too extreme. Just a couple rips on the knees and then the butt is actually like a little bit lighter, so I feel like this kind of enhances your booty a little bit because it kind of brings attention to that area. Just like with makeup, when you highlight an area, you, you want it to stand out, so it's the same way with jeans. I also have this like light wash on the thigh, which I think is also very flattering. And the bottom of these are really cute. They just have this kind of like raw edge. I just love these jeans. They're so stretchy and these run so true to size. Like look at the stretch on here. I would say get your normal size in these because I sometimes wear a size 3, which you will see there's a couple jeans here that are a size 3. But I'm typically a 1 in like most brands. Yeah, I am a size 1 in these ones and they fit so true to size. These are so stretchy. Alright, moving on, I did also pair the bodysuit with these jeans as well because I thought it would go. And these ones are the Lux High Waist Skinny Jeans. I got these in a size 1 as well and these are very true to size as well. Very, very stretchy and they're just really comfortable. These ones don't have as much stretch as the other pair, so I would say these are pretty true to size. If you're concerned, you can size up, but I feel like these are pretty true to size. So these I like because they're just a dark wash, but they also do have like a little bit of kind of a lighter effect here on the thigh. So it just gives your legs like definition. The backs are the back is just very simple, but I think it's very flattering. So yeah, these are just like a basic kind of jean, but I love love these so much they fit so nice if you look if you're looking for just a regular dark pair of high-waisted denim 
these are the ones to try. All right, moving on to the next item. This is a shirt that I paired with the next pair of jeans that I'm gonna talk about, which I love. But this is a bodysuit, and this is the Not Your Girl bodysuit in a size extra small. Yellow, you guys know I love my yellow. I'm not gonna lie, in person it's a little bit more of a mustard yellow. On camera it's showing up a little more like of a brighter yellow. This bodysuit is really cool because you can wear it like a crop top or you can wear it as a bodysuit. And the reason I say that is because when I actually first tried this on, um, the bodysuit part was like tucked underneath and it like looked like a crop top when I first put it on so I was like oh my god this is actually you could wear this as a crop top if you wanted to and just tuck the actual like bodysuit part under which I did show you guys in the clips because I personally think it looks flattering either way so this does have like a bat wing sleeve on it which I think is really flattering the material is so stretchy as you can see so I would say this is very true to size. If anything, the extra small was even a little bit big on me. So I would definitely either size down or get your size. And I did pair this with these jeans, which I love. I think they're so cute. So these I did get in a size 3, and I'm actually really glad because the material on these is not as stretchy as the other jeans. They are stretchy, but it's not like super stretchy. So I did size up in these ones. These are the Take Back Homegirl Skinny Jeans Light Blue Wash. Now what I really liked about these is the buttons. I just think they're so pretty and the rips in them are also really cute. I just love ripped denim. You guys must know that by now. And what I also love about these is the bottom of them has this kind of like raw fringy detail right here, but also it has the rips in the back side as well. The only thing with these is when you're putting them on, your foot kind of gets stuck in the hole, so you just have to like be really gentle when you put them on. I mean, honestly, these aren't the most flattering jeans on the butt. Like they don't like enhance your butt, but they don't like flatten it either. They're just like a nice pair of jeans. They almost remind me of like a mom jean, but a mom jean, but like a tighter version. Next up, oh my gosh, I am obsessed with this. This this is actually a bodysuit that I paired with the next pair of jeans that I'm gonna talk about. And this is, I can't remember the name of this bodysuit because I took the tag off, but I'm gonna have everything linked down below for you guys. I did get this in a size small. This is so cute, I love this. So it is a white bodysuit and it has these kind of like little, I don't know what you would call these, they're like little studs. It does have this kind of slight v-neck detail and the back of it is so pretty. It has a crisscross detail and obviously it is a bodysuit. This is so true to size, so comfortable, I love it so much. And I did pair it with th these pair of jeans right here, which are the, Lux high waist skinny jeans. These are in a size one. So we are back at a size one and these are very true to size. They're very, very stretchy. So I just, I would say get your normal size in these because I think they're pretty true to size. For anything like super extravagant or anything, they're just kind of like a basic light pair of denim and they do have a little bit of like the light wash going down in the front. So I like them for that. Again, it accentuates you in all the right places. And the back is just kind of like a basic kind of jean, nothing too crazy. But again, I just wanted a light pair of denim that didn't have any rips in them, that were high-waisted. All right, moving on, I think I also paired that shirt with these jeans as well. These ones are the Beach Bum jeans, and I got these in a size three. I actually have the lighter wash of the Beach Bum jeans and I love them, but I think I have them in a size 1 and the only reason why I sized up is because these are a little bit harder to get like around your feet, if that makes sense. They're a little bit harder to put on, but they are that stretchy material, so it's up to you if you want to get your true size or size up. Either way, I think you're going to be okay. So I did get these in a 3. And this is what they look like. I'm sure you guys have seen the beach bum jeans like all over. They're very like well known for their beach bum jeans. They're so cute. I love this kind of um, hole that they got going on. I love like the rectangle shape. These are just really flattering. I like to cut the bottom because I think that they make them look a little bit cuter. And I am glad that I got these in a size 3 because they do fit really, really nicely. Alright, moving on is this shirt. This shirt I was so sad about. I love it so much, but this you definitely want to size up in. Um, this is the 
Anastasia or Anastasia crop top in a size extra small. I would definitely size up in this because it's really hard to put on. Not only is it hard to put on, but it's really hard to move around in just because it's pretty tight. So it's this little lace crop top, you guys. This is so, so cute. The sleeves kind of like balloon out a little bit. I just think this shirt is so cute. It ties up in the front. So this does fit me, but it's uncomfortable. Um, I don't feel like I can really move around in it, but it's so cute. So I think I'm going to exchange it for a size small. So I would definitely, definitely size up in this one if you are going to get it. And then these pair of jeans are the come up ankle jeans and these ones are in a size one these ones are just a light pair of denim they have like one rip on this side and then kind of like a not fake rip but it doesn't like open up at all so it's kind of like a closed hole so these ones are very stretchy you guys really really comfortable really stretchy these are so so nice i really like these i definitely recommend them and the bottom had that cute little kind of frilled detail but they kind of come up a little in the front so if you wear heels with these it would look so cute so really really liked these ones as well all right we have another pair of jeans now these ones are tied up with the first jeans i love these ones so much you guys i took the tag off these ones but i think they're like called the smiley high rise jean or something like that um they had them in a dark wash and I wanted them so bad but they were sold out so I went with the light wash instead. I did get these in a size 3, very true to size, very comfortable. This is what they look like. They are a light wash but something about the way these look, I just really like them. They look like really expensive if that makes sense. I don't know, I just, I really like the, I really like the tone of color in them and they just have like a couple rips on the knees and I love the contouring of them. I love how they have like that light kind of bleached out effect. The back of them is pretty simple. It just has like a little bit of like a rip there. And they are high rise. I love these so much. The bottom of them also has that really cute um, kind of frilled detail right there. I love these jeans so much. I could have probably gone with a one and they probably would have fit fine. But the three is very comfortable, you know, on the bloated days that you don't want your jeans squeezing you to death. So I really love these. I think definitely one of my favorite from Fashion Nova for sure. So next up we have this top, and I think I actually paired it with those jeans. Yeah, I definitely did. This is the, what is the name of this? This is the Talk That Talk Off The Shoulder Top. I'm sure you guys have seen this as well. I feel like this is always like posted on their Instagram and I feel like so many people own this top. I actually own this top in the darker green color, but I have that one in a size extra small and I sized up and I got a small because when I would wear the other one in an extra small, the buttons would bust open and I would have like a situation. So I definitely recommend sizing up in this if you don't want that to happen, which I'm sure you don't because I was actually out to dinner with my boyfriend and one of the middle buttons unbuttoned and he was like, oh, pal. Um, and I was like, oh my god. So I definitely wanted to size up, but other than that, it's such a gorgeous top. I know you guys hate that I own so many crop tops, but I just, I just like crop tops because you can put them with high-waisted jeans and it doesn't look weird. I feel like regular shirts don't go with high-waisted jeans unless you like tuck them in or if you have a bodysuit. And I'm into high-waist jeans lately. I just, that's all I wear. Next up, we have this shirt, which I was... I'm gonna be honest, I don't love this shirt, but I found that when I tuck it into a pair of jeans, I like it a lot more. So this shirt doesn't have a tag on it, so I'm not sure the name of it, but I did get it in a size small. It is this really pretty like taupey shade, and it is um, off the shoulder. But what I will say about this one is, it is one of those shirts where if you like move around a lot, it's obviously gonna like keep coming up. It's not one of those shirts that that's gonna like stay off the shoulder. It is like all connected here, so it's not like a separate sleeve. I usually like when off the shoulder shirts have like a separate sleeve attached so it doesn't really move around. That's like my only kind of like eh about it, but it is kind of like a flowy shirt. I like this tucked into a pair of jeans because I don't know, I don't think that it really suits me when it's not tucked in. I don't really love the way it looks on me. But other than that, I think it's a really cute shirt. I did pair it with these last two pairs of jeans that I'm going to talk about and then we are done. 
And these jeans I did get in a size 1. These are the Precious Fit High Waisted Jean. Now these look very similar to a lot of the other jeans, but something is different about the material. It is like, it is that typical jegging, like really, really soft material. They don't feel like jeans. They're definitely a jegging. They're so, so soft. I could stretch out across this room. It's so stretchy. So I would definitely say get your normal size in these ones. And these are just a basic no ripped blue jean. And I know that I already showed a pair of jeans that didn't have rips in them, but to me they look different than these. I don't know. I have like a jean obsession and I will never get rid of any of my jeans because they all have their own different things about them. So I know that these are another pair of basic, you know, skinny jeans, but I just think they look different. The back of them is just like your basic you know, back pockets, nothing crazy. Um, I do tend to roll these ones up because they are super long. So if you're tall, these would work for you because I'm 5'2 and I definitely have to roll them up. I feel like these are definitely longer than any of the other jeans I've talked about. I so yeah, keep that in mind. If you are short, you're definitely going to want to roll them up. But if you're tall, I feel like these would be your kind of jean. And then the last pair of jeans unfortunately did not fit me so I couldn't do a try on clip of these because they were way too small which is very odd because I'm typically either a one or a three with them but these are a one and they did not fit me at all I couldn't even get them like past my legs because my legs are a little bit muscular so these are definitely made for the girl that has you know really really tiny legs these are the canopy jeans and these are also very well known on Fashion Nova I own these in they're colored ones, so they have like the jean canopy jeans, and then they have like a green, a black, a red, and I think that's it. And I own the red, and I love them, and I think I might have those in a three. Um, so I definitely feel like I would need to size up in these, and I would love them. They're so, so nice. So what they look like, you can tell how tiny they are by just looking at them. Like the back of them is so, so small. So their canopy jeans are known for like that little slit that raw slit in the knee, which I think is so, so cute, but unfortunately, they did not make it past my legs. So that completes this video, you guys. I hope that you guys found it helpful. I can't stress it enough. I love their jeans. Like, it is what it is. I know a lot of people are on the fence of Fashion Nova because it's very, very hyped up on Instagram, but it's for a reason. Their stuff is very affordable, and I think it's really good quality. Like, a lot of this stuff beats Forever 21 quality out of the park. I love Forever 21, but their stuff never lasts for me, and it just gets, like, faded and, like, I, I don't know. I just really recommend Fashion Nova. I think that it's definitely worth checking out. If you guys have been thinking about ordering from Fashion Nova, but you're not sure, please try them just once, and I, I definitely think that you guys would really enjoy their stuff. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video, found it helpful. Let me know down below if you guys have any questions. So that's pretty much it. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!